Hey guys, this is Samantha coming to you with another business and entrepreneurship tip. Do not run your business alone. Do not run your business alone. One man shops are overrated and unsuccessful. You have to have a team, even if it's interns. For years, I worked with only interns and those interns were like employees. They helped me get a lot of stuff done and you would not know that they were interns. You have to have a team to help you. You are not skilled in every area. And even if you are, you can't have yourself spread too thin. You have to focus on as a business owner, as an entrepreneur, as the one in charge, you have to focus on the big things and the main things and allow people to do the other things. So if you're doing everything, then how are you getting stuff done effectively? And then even if you are getting things done effectively, what kind of life do you have outside of work? You want to balance it to where you have a team working on certain things that are their areas of expertise. Now, just because you know how to do something doesn't mean that's your area of expertise. So marketing may be something you can do, but if you have someone who can do marketing, who specializes in marketing, who's trained in that area, that's the right thing to do. Accounting, get you an accountant so you're not handling the financials. And guess what? It's gonna be done perfectly. It's gonna be done on time. It's gonna be done right. And you'll have time to focus on other things that are going to grow the business because ultimately it's about your bottom line and that revenue source, that partnership, um, partnerships that you have. So you want to make sure you have a team in place. Get the interns, spend the money to get the staff. Get family and friends. I have a family member working for me now and works like 20 hours a week. So you guys spend the money, spend the time and make sure you invest in your business by having a team. Do not do your business alone. Until next time, I encourage you business owners, entrepreneurs as well to rise above because we have so many challenges. You can rise above those challenges. You can rise like the the rise above trauma, rise above setbacks and rise like the phoenix so you can be great in your business. Until next time, we'll see you later.